I say it was, it was a big time win for us, you know, state rivalry. Um, you know, you can say you own the state for the year until the next time, into the next matchup. Um, I think we went through a little bit of adversity tonight and we responded well, both sides positive and negatively. I think that was big for this team just to go on the road because we don't have many road games. It's not a conference schedule. Just go on the road and you just pre prepare for the future and then you prepare looking towards Alabama A&M coming in home, then going to the Bahamas. But I think it was a big time win for us. This game was really a scrum in a lot of ways for really for over for over a half. Uh, what and you know that being that being said, kind of what did you learn about this this group? You know, getting through that and finishing strong like you guys did. I would say what I learned about this team is just there's no quitting this team. You know, they took they took a lead. I want to say uh, going into the before the under eight, they took a lead and. You know, I think we were just in the huddle just saying respond. No matter what, let's just keep playing hard. We've been here before. You know, just keep playing no matter what. And Coach White was big on us just being poised and being calm. And obviously, us being poised and calm down the stretch, we're not winning the game. And 0 for 14 on threes before he said that big, big one that, that he did. When, once he hit it, how much did you guys kind of just kind of relax whenever that went down? I mean, you know, we're a team that attempt a lot of threes. So, you know, just to see that we struggled at first and everybody just stayed with it. Nobody second guessed those, those attempts going up in the second half. I think. Him hitting that big time three just took the lid off the goal first, and we just took off running from there. Salas, you wound up being the leading scorer for you guys tonight. Just how did you feel like you played uh, what was working for you? Um, I kind of just let the game come to me. You know, I think kind of looking at teams we play, I'm kind of towards the top of the scout. So I just got to figure out ways to just adjust as soon as the game starts, see how teams are playing me. I just think my biggest thing is just getting my teammates involved. Because once I start getting my teammates involved, it opens up more scoring opportunities for me, more more times to dish the ball up, hit open guys for threes. So I think just getting my teammates involved earlier or allow my opportunities down the stretch to open up. What did you feel like was working for you guys defensively? It seemed like for the most part, you guys kept them in check as far as your shooters. I think us just, uh, you know, working on it every day. You know, we have some of the best shooters, I feel like, in the nation. So we work on stunting in the gap and get back to shooters, running them off the line, and trusting each other on the backside, being in the gap. And then, you know, obviously we have great bigs, you know, alter shots and everything like that. And then we have Ace and something they can switch on the guards and we have confidence that they'll be able to get a stop. So. What'd you